Liverpool Biennial is a free festival of contemporary art. Happens around the city of Liverpool every two years. This year we're in nine venues and we've got seven outdoor works as well. We've also got an online portal and we're doing learning programme as well. The indoor exhibitions are spread across the city. So some of them are in venues that you know really well, like Tate Liverpool, in Fact, in Blue Coat, in Open Eye. And then what we've also done is taken over venues that you might not have been inside or not been inside for a really long time. So this, for some people, actually probably isn't that recognisable, but we are standing in the former Lewis's department store, which I know so many people in Liverpool have got so many stories about. And so that's one of our spaces. We're also in the bottom of the Cotton Exchange. So if you go in that building and we're in the basement, it's this kind of extraordinary maze of corridors and rooms that have also been used for film sets. And we've got works installed there that look amazing. And then we're in the Martin Luther King Jr. building as well, which is down by Albert Dock, which is just incredible to be in the first exhibition in that space. It feels really important to have a biennial right now for loads of different reasons. I mean, one reason is that the artists and everybody here at the Biennial has been working on it for so long. We've got so many amazing works of art that we just need to make it happen. And the other thing is it's like this amazing opportunity to start coming back into the city again, to see exhibitions for free, to see art in real life, experiencing works like the materiality, literal material in this um, example, or the sound or the smell of works of art and being close to them and also doing that with other people. So instead of being on your own at home, you're in a gallery space or a found space and there are other people experiencing those things too. And that idea that we might feel something together, even though we're separate, is amazing.